Sean Livernoche teaches school full time. Wife Megan works for a pharmaceutical company. They love to come home and enjoy their shared collection of 1980s arcade games. Started out in our one bedroom apartment up in Lawrence, uh, about 900 square feet, and um, we noticed, I think, when we got to 14 full size arcade cabinets, that it was a little much. Rather than part with the games, the couple bought a storefront in downtown Burlington, New Jersey. They live upstairs. The games live on the first floor. Their gaming lifestyle grew out of watching a DVD. In the documentary King of Kong inspired me to go out and get a Donkey Kong. And I, I'm, you know, I set out to, uh, to get the world record because that was what the film was about. And man, I'm telling you, I fell on my face. Sean quickly realized he was a pretty ordinary player, but once the collection went public, world record holders started showing up just to play the games they miss. The Tron Guinness Book World Record Champion of the World has been here to play it more than once, you know, from Florida. He's traveled here to play this Tron. So sometimes the rewards for putting some time into resurrecting one of these pieces of equipment uh, really pays off big time. But the couple's biggest thrill is when everyday gamers, mostly middle-aged men, show up to relive memories and maybe make some new ones. They just get so excited to see something that, you know, they thought they lost.